Hey guys, my name is Honey Lee, and you are watching a U review. Tell us, uh, what have you been up to lately? Uh, I guess the last time we saw you, you know, you were in Neighbours. Yeah. Now, you know, we find you in Seoul. So what's been, <laughs> what's been happening since that time that, uh, that you left Neighbours? Ah, oh, that was so long ago as well. So, um, you know, people changed within a few months. So uh, in like a few years, so much has happened. Um, and yeah, um, I've been performing different places, different companies. Um, I just recently finished um, filming with Wentworth the TV drama as well in Australia. Um, and now I'm here in Seoul with Aria Creations, what, what? Um, and yeah, so um, we're just preparing for my pre deb first, and then we'll go on to the debut. So we're safe and we have that amazing supportful fan base that we've been looking for. So, yeah. What made you decide that, uh, that K-pop is a an area that you want to pursue? It's mostly because it's different to the whole indie vibe, the mainstream vibe. I mean, of course, K-pop itself is mainstream within its center. But, um, you know, Aria Creations has this different phase. It's got this different vibe. It's not just K-pop, it's, it's global. And that was really, something about it was so sexy for me. I don't know, it was just really attractive. And um, yeah, that's what drew me to it, definitely. And how's your training been coming along um, in the K-pop world? So good, so fun. It's, um, it's so different, like I said, because I'm from an acting background. I came from musical theatre and stage and um, screen. And now I'm like doing real stuff, like where I'm actually like working out, like getting physical, I'm actually touching my <laughs> instruments and like, um, you know, getting to know my instruments better and uh, physically working. So it's, it's so good, it's so good. What is a <coughs> typical day for you? A What's typical a, day. Yeah. Every day is very, very different for me. Mm -hmm. There's not one day where it's the same because we're always doing something new, something creative and something different. And um, I think that's what's kept me motivated to come this far because it's just so exciting. I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow. <laughs> How did you actually get scouted for K-pop? Uh, well, the creative director of Aria Creations were... Uh, they were already scouting. I didn't know this, of course, but um, I was doing a uni voice, this competition back in Australia. And um, luckily they, you know, produced some material which went up on YouTube um, and up on the web. And I was lucky enough for them to see that. And um, yeah, they just gave me a buzz and they're like, yo, what's up, honey Lee? Like, come down to the studio. <laughs> and the rest is history. Yeah. <laughs> the rest is it wasn't that yeah. simple, but um, you, you get the you get the flow. Right. So let's talk about your upcoming yeah. release or the uh, I guess it's got the pre-debut, is that right? How exciting. Yeah, what's what's it sounding like at the moment? Oh, it is a secret to behold. Yes, definitely. Um we've got like I said, it's not just gonna be K pop mainstream. So you definitely have to be waiting for this because it's got this global touch. And because Aria Creations, um, it's got this Greece, European background as well. So we've definitely got that history involved as well. And so Is there a particular concept that you're looking for as well in your mind? Have you think, well, okay, this is you know, the particular video clip that I want to do or? Oh, we're always being creative. Mm -hmm. We, we have act, we've actually, the problem is we have too many ideas, you know, um, and I think that that's what proves um, that a person is an artist mm -hmm. because we're always so creative. Yeah. Um, Let's talk about your time in Seoul. Mm -hmm. how, how are you enjoying living in Seoul, living, working, breathing in Seoul? Breathing the pollution. Ah! <laughs> oh my God, I miss Australia so much. Um, I love Seoul. I mean, it's my it's it's my background. It's it's in my blood, and so of course I love Seoul. I love Korea. I love the culture because it's so different. Um, <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah. There's so much to learn still. So much to learn. Even though I'm Korean myself, there's just so much to learn. And um, 
I definitely love it. I want to I wanna go out more. I want to go out and see what the nightlife is like or the day life is like, you know. Um, so, yeah, more adventures to come for Honey Lee. I'm sure we'll exchange notes afterwards about all the good places to go to. Yeah, let's. <laughs>